I distinctly remember the first time I thought about being a Jesuit. I went to straight Jesuit uh, college prep in Houston and uh, our junior year we went on a retreat called the Prayer Styles Retreat and this thought just came over me like, hey, have you ever thought about being a priest? And then ended up going to talk to uh, the chair of our theology department when we got back to campus uh, and he said, go to college. <laughs> and so I have really enjoyed Jesuit formation. Initially I taught third grade at the Good Shepherd School in New Orleans and then I was in Belize City, uh, Belize as a campus minister at St. John's College for about four months. Coupled with the academic work is this, this really strong background of, of working with people and kind of honing our skills as ministers and pastors and taking the stuff that we're doing in the classroom and then bringing it kind of into real life somewhere. I was a water sports person growing up. I swam and played water polo in high school. I hated running and then I got to St. Louis for first studies and uh, I, I was this this guy on the treadmill who would just walk for 45 minutes and I, I felt ridiculous but slowly and slowly and slowly I was able to, to run a little more and run a little more up to the point that my last year of Regency in Houston I actually did the half marathon. Right when I went to college I actually worked on the ambulance for, for quite a while and then uh, that led to a job working for uh, one of the county fire departments in Houston. Every time you get a call on the ambulance, you show up and it's a new puzzle, and you're trying to put together these puzzle pieces and figure out how to solve the problem, how to help someone, how to make their day better. And I think that that plays a lot into what Jesuits do, right? We're constantly called into different situations where we don't have all the information and we don't necessarily know what came before or what's going to come after, but trying to figure out how to put that puzzle together and help someone is a really neat thing to be able to do. I can be picked up and put here and here, and no matter what it is, God's hand is in it and God's heart is with me, and so I can be firm and steadfast and courageous uh, because the Lord is with me.